In a recent interview, <laughs> Wreck-It Ralph star John C. Riley revealed that work is being done on a Wreck-It Ralph 2 <laughs> and that he has signed on to do the sequel as well. The 2012 film made over $470 million at the worldwide box office and was hailed by both critics and fans. John, is it time for another Wreck-It Ralph film? No, it's past time. A, a new Wreck-It Ralph <laughs> film honestly should have been coming out, should have came out in 2015. Look, I'm not one of these guys where Oh, the movie's good? Have another one out next year. No, I'm, I'm not one of those. But like two or three years later, because Wreck-It Ralph is not like a generations-long property that like Star Trek or like Star Wars or like James Bond where, hey, you can wait five or six years and everybody's still totally fresh up on your property. And it's not like four years is going to kill Wreck-It Ralph. But still, Wreck-It Ralph was such a pleasant surprise. I don't I don't think there were many people who were expecting it to be as good and as entertaining as it really turned out to be because it's just a wonderful film. Should have won the Academy Award for Best Animated Film that year, but I digress. Um, <laughs> I, it's just at this point, they're still talking about it and John C. Riley's just now saying, yeah, I, I'm signed up to do it and there's movement happening. At this point, we're not going to get one until at the earliest 2017. And that's like a five-year gap. I... So, look, in the absence of having one already, yeah, it's time to get things moving on this. They should absolutely, I think every year they wait is a little bit of a missed opportunity. That's what I think anyway. Mark, what do you think? Well, we, we've been whining on this show recently about how there just isn't a good video game adaptation since Mortal Kombat, but the movie that had a bunch of video game characters in it was awesome, yeah. and so we definitely need another Wreck-It Ralph. And part of me wonders that maybe they haven't done another one yet because whenever you do a sequel, you want to go bigger, you want to go badder, you want to have more characters in there, and some crucial video game characters that they didn't have the rights to yet when they made the first Wreck-It Ralph, maybe they're trying to work on a deal to get some of the Marios in there, or Bomberman, or Lara Croft from Tomb Raider, or Earthworm Jim, or just more characters that we didn't get to meet in the first one. But yeah, it's it, it's past time to have one. I think that if it comes out in 2017, 2018, that'd be great. It's still going to be in the consciousness because video games aren't going anywhere, you know? They, right. video Playing video games is going to be, is only going to get better and better and better. So I think having these movies movies, especially the second one comes out and does well, that they will, you'll start to see more Wreck-It Ralphs every two to three years. Now, the rumor I'm hearing is that, that the direction they're looking at going in for the next Wreck-It Ralph is Wreck-It Ralph actually jumps into the online gaming and console gaming world. That so would be that really would be, Yeah, that's the rumor wow. I hear at any rate. How much validity there is to that, I don't know. But that is a very interesting, because that opens up a whole new universe for Wreck-It Ralph. Anyway, Schnepp, what do you think? I love the first Wreck-It Ralph, and I, I was like one of those people who was like, ah, I guess I'll go see it, and then blown away at how much fun it was. Plus, Kubert was in it. <laughs> and Kubert was good. Kubert was great. He's one of my favorite characters. Yeah, he's in Pixels, but I want him in Wreck-It Ralph, too, and like I want the Psychonauts and a whole bunch of other characters to be in Wreck-It Wreck-It Ralph 2. I think Wreck-It Ralph 2, hopefully they'll they'll get it on the slates for 2017 and just make the announcement, stake out the dates, you know? Do you guys remember that video game Burger Time? Yes, I love Burger Time. I want time. the Burger Time guy oh. in that. That game was so awesome. Yeah, you're like, like throwing pepper at the eggs are chasing you and like trying to make that sandwich, you know? Absolutely. I want him in there. I don't know why, but I want him in there really bad. All right, I need to Google Burger Time. <laughs> oh, I need it's I fantastic. It's a great game. Yeah. It's very tense, too, like because you walk somewhat slow and it's like, brook, 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 and like weird <laughs> eggs are chasing you and like weird fries I don't and like stuff. It. And you're trying to accumulate hard, a burger Yeah, together? you're trying to make burgers. You got to run over the, the bun, then you got to run over the tomato. No, but to make the, it drop into the burger. Well, I can make burgers. <laughs> but the most satisfying thing is to crush your opponents under the weight of a giant biscuit bun or whatever. It's like <laughs> you walk over and you watch them get crushed as you make your burger. Oh, the other thing about, about uh, Wreck-It Ralph 2. Burger time or Wreck-It Ralph? Burger time. No, burger, but the other thing about uh, Wreck-It Ralph 2 is that uh, the director has said th that he really wants to have a key role for Mario. In it, but right. they, you know, Nintendo's very tight gripped on their property, so they've been having a hard time. So maybe we can get Mario and Luigi in there. That would be actually kind of cool. That would fit in well. 